Coming back home, South Africa and Russia are to embark on a full trade relations with both countries, opening up their markets for each other. This emerged during a two-day business roundtable discussion held in Pretoria. A cordial meeting where both Pretoria and Moscow committed each other to a more meaningful and fruitful trade and business relations. Minister Jeff Hadebe said the meeting should deepen these relations to further benefit both countries' economies. This must also translate into greater trade opportunities, higher investment and faster economic growth. And this will require the development of meaningful public-private partnerships. We must also energize practical cooperation to boost our development. But South Africa was more concerned about the poor cross-investment trade between the two countries. The two have signed over 40 agreements, including mining, technology and science. Uh, yes, sure, the investment uh, procedure is, of course, two-way, as a uh, street with two-way of traffic, and I'm sure that Russian investors would come and open up for themselves and discover the opportunities. Minister Zwani said mutual investment is the way to go and that a lot of companies would like to invest in South Africa. In our bilaterals with them, we have emphasized the issue of Russians coming to South Africa, also investing here. We committed ourselves to also take our own mining companies to Far East in September next year. Another area of progress, the visa-free regime between South Africa and Russia has been put into operation. According to the minister, it will contribute to the development of business and tourism areas of the two countries. Both countries' ministers declined to comment on the progress of the nuclear deal, which has sparked a lot of debate on whether South Africa needs it or not. Lehana Tutiti, SABC News, Pretoria.